The United Nations and its humanitarian partners are seeking 4.3 billion euros to aid millions of Afghans as the country struggles in the wake of the Taliban takeover. It's the UN's largest ever appeal to help a country which is on the brink of a humanitarian crisis and economic collapse. According to UN figures, more than 13 million children are in dire need of food, shelter and medical care. The two out of three children in desperate need of, of humanitarian aid, that's a rise of over a third since the beginning of last year. So we're seeing queues at our mobile health clinics with more and more patients presenting with malnutrition and with pneumonia. And we're seeing adults with malnutrition as well. Afghanistan's aid-reliant economy was thrown into turmoil following the Taliban takeover. While their assets were subsequently frozen predominantly by the US, international aid organisations are allowed in. Save the Children has been distributing cash to ensure families can buy essential food items to get them through the winter months. Clothes and blankets have also been handed out. It's a prerequisite that the help goes to the people, not the Taliban. But the UN says much more help is required and that the international community needs to step up 